everybody, Jake Yencarelli here, the Yencarelli Group at Keller Williams Realty Base Camp, Tampa Bay, Florida. Uh, here bringing you your local market update. Uh, we are now in June um, and our MLS board will have our um, May numbers out to us very shortly. And yet I was looking at some trends through April I wanted to show you. Um, looking at a, a quick market update for Pinellas County, Pasco County, and Hillsborough County. Uh, taking a look at Pinellas, over the last seven months, we've seen an increase in inventory year over year and a decrease in sales volume year over year. Now we're still trending month over month of inventory levels dropping and month over month sales volume increasing. And yet what we're seeing is that that trend is narrowing. What that means is that it's a little bit of a softening of our markets that are happening right now. You might be feeling that, you might be sensing that. Um, if you have your house on the market right now, maybe getting a, a, a little bit longer days on market than what you might be expecting. And yet still a great time to get your home listed. It's just, we have to be very strategic when it comes to our pricing strategy in Pinellas County. Uh, looking at Hillsborough County, um, very much the same news. So the last eight months in a row, we have seen a year over year increase in inventory. That hasn't been the trend the last several years. Uh, we are seeing kind of mixed results when it comes to sales volume. Some months up, some months down, year over year. Overall, though, we are still seeing a steady decrease in inventory uh, month, uh, month over month and a steady increase in sales volume. And yet again, those margins are tightening a little bit, which means it's not quite as aggressive as it was even a year ago when we were seeing those 10 and 12% appreciation rates um, in our markets. Uh, when it comes to Pasco County, um, also kind of trending on the same trend. Pasco does a little bit less volume than Hillsborough and Pinellas. And yet, for the most part, year over year, we're seeing an increase in inventory. September, October, November, December, January, February, all inventory levels rising year over year, although they are dropping um, pretty steadily as as the, uh, as the year goes on month over month. We did, however, see in March inventory levels drop. April, they stayed level, and we'll see how May turns out for us. Um, and then also, it's been kind of a mixed result when it comes to the sales volume. Ultimately, what that means is you're, you're likely getting a sense right now that our markets are starting to stabilize a little bit. We've had extremely aggressive appreciation over the last five years, double digit appreciation. We're gonna see that start to narrow. Um, Looking at the experts, they're really not saying we're in, in uh, a storm of a crash or a bubble, anything like that. We're just kind of seeing a correction happening. Still a great time to sell. Interest rates are still low, so still a great time to buy. If you have any questions about your local market, your neighborhood, we drill these numbers down to the micro level as well and look at each city, each neighborhood independently. So let me know if you have any questions. Again, Jake Yencarelli, Keller Williams Realty, the Yencarelli Group at Basecamp Tampa Bay. Have a great day.